Sain and Kevin couldn't have done it now without it getting out. I got the press into the Potter's Heron Hotel on a Monday lunchtime, and on the top table there was my chairman, Alan Woodford, and, and me on the other side, and Alan sat there, and he all looked a bit tense, and Alan said he thought he was on This Is Your Life. <laughs> and at the given time, there was a knock on the door, all the press were there, and I, I said whatever I was gonna say. I uh, got a bit of a surprise for you lads. Tap on the door, the chairman's big thing was, and I'd only told the board, a couple of days before, one director knew, the financial director, because he obviously had to come to London with me and um, meet up with Kevin. Uh, and the tap on the door came, he went along, opened the door, a lady came in with a baby in her arms, Mrs. Keegan, Jean Keegan, and Kevin. There was a gasp and the press stood up and, and clapped. They didn't, nobody knew till he walked in the door. The impact was unbelievable, because uh, he, he was European Player of the Year twice. He was still in the England team, and um, to come to Southampton was uh, not on everybody's mind. And is it right that it all came about because you needed a light fitting? No, that was my excuse. It came about because I knew, I'd, I'd read in the paper that he'd been at Hamburg for so long, and. I, and he was getting linked with different clubs and all that sort of thing. And, um, and in my mind I thought, ooh, that'd be a good, you know, good fit in, we just needed somebody like that. And uh, at the same time, we were moving house and the man that was helping us with the house, Norman Woodford, who's still around, <clears throat> he said, I've got an idea for that staircase wall. He said, put this sort of light on. I said, what's the problem? He said, well, you don't, they make them in Germany. Oh, I said, whereabouts? He says, Hamburg. I said, really? I said, well, I'll tell you what, give me the detail. And um, I then found out the number for Kevin. Uh, I got talking to him, I said, look, I'm, I'll tell you why I'm ringing you, there's a light. Uh, any chance if I order it, you could maybe get it back? You know, when you come, to pay, yeah, give us the detail and all that sort of thing, I left it at that. Um, didn't say anything about football. And then I think I gave it a week or so and then rang back and said, hey, but, uh, how are you getting on with the lights? He said, oh, no problem, no problem. And I said, hey, I've been reading, you might go to Real Madrid or Barcelona or somewhere. Well, he said, I'm getting it. I said, you've got a baby, haven't you? I said, gotta be careful, you know, these, you know, you're so famous, uh, minders and all. Anyway, I put the phone down and every time I rang, I got nearer and nearer. And then eventually one day I said, look, well, I was making arrangements for where to meet him when he came with the light. And um, I said, have you ever thought about coming back here to England? And, and I said, what about our team? Um, and he didn't say no, he didn't say yes. Uh, we agreed to have a chat and um, there was a supporter, I can't remember his name, who had a house in London. And I, I arranged for him to let us use his house. Didn't tell him why. And when the door went, I said, I'll get it. And I went, brought him in, put him in the front room. The fella in the house didn't even know. And the three of us sat there, small talk. And we were talking away about possible things. And then eventually Kevin said, I got a contract. And I went, a contract? And I looked at Guy, asked him, and Guy had brought a blank contract. He said, give me it, and he signed. And I went, Phew. I won't tell you exactly what I said, but I, I couldn't believe that. He said, well, I've got something to tell you. I said, what? He said, I forgot to bring your light. I went, to hell with the light, forget it. He was playing for England that, that week, and I'm up with Wembley on the Wednesday night, and I'm sitting there watching, and I'm watching him, and I'm thinking, he's our player, like, you know. I'm the only one on the ground, that, apart from him, that knew. And uh, I don't know how long it was after that that we made the announcement, got him over, and pff, fantastic.